Hello everyone, welcome back to another daily Minecraft tutorial, and today we are going to be showing you how to get resource packs, formerly known as texture packs for Minecraft version 1.21.4. Take it away! Yeah, thank you. So in this video you will indeed learn how to get resource packs for Minecraft. So, first of all, you need a resource pack. So here I have my web browser. And I have a resource pack in mind, which is the Fateful 32, pretty popular. So I'll just search it up and download Fateful. There will also be a link in the description if you want as well. So simply just look it up if you want. Fateful 32. And here we have it right here. Fatefulpack.net. If we go on the official website for this texture pack, here we see, okay, we have the website, we have downloads, and we just wait for downloads to show up. Here we just take the latest one. The version does not really matter when it comes to actually making it work. So that's always pretty useful. So, there you go. Here we have the texture pack, a resource pack, downloading. We can see it right here. It's verifying the, down the download and everything should be completely fine. Once this thing has verified, aka when it's actually gone, there you go. Now we can close the web browser. Okay. So, next step. What you need to do is simply go to your file explorer. And go to your downloads folder. Now, mine's the default one. Yours could be different. So, make sure you know where your downloads actually go. But for most of you, it should just be in downloads. Here we see I have one folder. And it's zipped. This should be what you have technically if you really have a pack. Now, it could be zipped or it could be unzipped. Both work. You don't need to unzip it if you have it already. So that's pretty good. So we just have a pack. And now what do we do? Well, what we do is just, well, close. There you go. File Mac Manager. And what we can do now is simply go to the Minecraft Launcher. The Minecraft Launcher being right here. It's the same step for any other types of launchers as well. So if you're using like modern for the central, whatever, whatever you want to use, it works. Right? It's going to be like this, even CurseForge. It will be the same step. What you want to do is make sure you have 1.10.4 or any version you want to use. We'll just be using this version for this. And just play. We want to have the Minecraft game actually be open. So let's just wait for Minecraft to open up real quick. Okay. Mm -hmm. There you go, perfect. Once Minecraft is here, we can continue. So, once we have this, what we want to do is go to Options. And go to Resource Packs. Okay, so it's quite simple from here. Here you should have the screen. Like I said, for any launcher, you will be seeing this. Now go to open pack folder. And you should have this. It should be an empty folder or if you somehow have packs prior, you will just have .minecraft resource packs selected. What you want to do is go to your downloads folder. Go to fade for or any pack you have. Select it. Copy it. Then go to the top left to this little arrow here. And clicking this once should bring you back to the prior folder, which is the resource pack folder. Now click paste. And then you shall have one folder in your resource pack folder. Here we can close the file manager. And we will see this. Now, don't be scared if it says incompatible. This doesn't mean anything. It just means that the actual resource pack has a older version of itself. Now, this is a Minecraft thing, so every new update delays the number of how the uh, resource pack version. If I if I go here, I can show you this actually. Uh, let's just open up the pack.mc meta, and here we can see pack format. Now, this pack format is smaller than the 1.21.4, so it will say incompatible, even though it is. It's completely fine. It's just you might have this thing, so it just it's a wording issue from Mojang, honestly, but it works completely fine. So we just activate this by you know, going here. So if we go back to arrow, yes, if it is older, 
and we just do done. Okay. And here we can see Minecraft has changed ready and the pack works. As this is a whole entire Minecraft changing pack, it will change the background to the older quote unquote version because that's what this pack does. But if you have other packs which are not completely overhaul of Minecraft, you will not have this issue. If you go in single player and tutorials, I can show you the faithful pack in action as well. It's night time, let's do flash game mode. Oh no, sorry, flash. Up, time, set, run. Okay, there you go. Hey, okay. So here we see that the pack has indeed affected how Minecraft works, as we can see. Now, if we want to turn off the pack, we go back to this page again and just click this arrow, done. And we will see Minecraft as it is, like this. If I turn it on again, arrow, yes, done. We will see like this. So, yeah, basically, that's how we do it. So, yeah, if you liked this video, make sure to like and subscribe, and see you for the next one. Bye!